What's up guys, that really just got here and we are back and as you can see on the screen, we are looking at Nidus. Now, there's a lot going on for this, uh, this, this episode, sort of, sort of. We're going to take a look at Nidus. However, heard through the grapevine, and by the grapevine, uh, grapevine I mean the wikia page for, uh, for Warframe, that Nidus is the key. And you're wondering, the key, the what? The door. Not that door, but that door. Oh boy. So, I've already done the, uh, the Glass Gambit quest. Um, I'm going to be editing that and setting that up uh, for you guys, and that's going to be the videos that are coming out after this one. However, once I heard this, I had to farm the parts up, and I rushed his uh, his design so it probably would have been better off just to purchase the frame right off the bat but I absolutely had to get in here and show you guys I am excited I have not been in there yet I confirmed it by literally just walking over to the door like this and then seeing if it would open and it did okay so we're gonna go in here kitty cat and all I don't know if kitty cat's gonna follow us in but we're gonna go in here this is the default color scheme by the way we'll look at that that night stuff later but we're going to go in here, and we're going to see what is up with this room. <laughs> it happened. What is going on? Disgusting, is it not, Operator? Or we just waiting to work? Virgin Vess. Uh, cleaning this room, but sadly this vile mass serves you and your war friends. A necessary evil. What? Sit? Oh, what? No way. Look at this room, though. Oh, we're gonna have to sit. That's a... That's a sleeping chamber. No way. This is super spoiler territory, probably, by the way, guys. Probably, by the way. Probably, what am I saying? Okay. Okay. We're going to sit down here. You can only supposedly get in here using the war or using this frame. Operator, no! Have you lost your mind? What is going on? What? What was that? Is it talking? What did it say? I wish to serve, yet I am weak. What? Guys, look at our frame now, especially. Time heals the mind. Seriously? Guys. Guys. Guys, like... We can't sit down again. I wonder. Hold on. Hold on. I'm curious. Just, just curious. Can I even get in there? Hi, kitty. Oh, door's open. There's our frame. We fear nothing but the void demon. What is that? A oh, void demon. We're the void demon. We went into the void. What? The inf infestation is scared of the Tenno. What? This is crazy, guys. Is that it? Is that really it? Like, what if I come out here? What if I am the Tenno? And then I try and go in there with my Warframe not in there. I'm just, well, I'm just curious. I just want to try, check all, check everything. Okay, I can't just go in there. I can't just go in there. Okay. 
We breathe for you, bleed for you. What? Can I sit down again? Feed for you. Oh. Oh, God. I'm so confused. This is crazy, though. Let's see if we can get our, our dude in here again. See if it says anything else. This is something else, guys. This is crazy. The demon is awake? How? Wow. So it knew we were asleep. This is a smart, like, smart creature. And why is this part of our Lisette? This is crazy. You, oh, guys, this is like into the lore. Okay, so I mentioned with the quest, I won't, I won't talk about it very much for, you know, for case of spoilers or whatever. I mentioned in the quest, um, I like the lore and stuff that came with it, but I wasn't too excited about the gameplay, but this makes it all worth it. Feed me, master. What? What? Okay. So I'm going to do this a few times and see what, what the dialogue is. This is awesome, guys. This is awesome. So let's see. Try it out. Go in here. We fear nothing but the voiding. Okay, so he said that. He said that in the past. I'll try one more time with the, with the frame, see if we get anything different. Maybe this is all his dialogue. Make sure that goes away before I go in there again. All right. Oh, and we put, oh, look. The Meridian's Awake, the Vital Pentatonic. The Meridian's Awake, what does that mean? <laughs> oh god, oh guys, this is crazy. Let's try it again, let's try it again, try it with the dude. Um, just to cover all the bases, because it looks like our, our frame has quite a few lines of dialogue. But our person, our Tenno, the demon's awake, how? Okay. 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 We'll try again. We, oh, I still want to take a look at the frame, like, in depth, but... Guys. Guys, I had to show you guys this. I had to show you guys this. I am weak, master. I think it already said that. Okay, cool. So... This is pretty... Uh, pretty intense. It's pretty crazy. But... Here we go. Nidus. Nidus. So here he is in all his glory. Pretty cool design. Pretty cool looking. Let's get into his appearance and whatnot. So, alternate helmet. Uh, in the picture, it looks like the splines and stuff opened up. So maybe that's his variation of when, you know, his, his, his infestation or whatever comes to its max. Um, so... Yeah, he does a little have a little bit of a rhino bulge um, going on with him as well. Um, he he's wearing heels, but oh, he's he's a pretty cool design. I I wasn't incredibly stoked for this frame, um, but with with the way it's set up in the dynamic, I am I am a little curious. So uh, I'm glad that this is kind of sent me to the point where I, I farmed him up right away because of the whole door thing. This is cool. This is cool. So there's his agile in, uh, animation and his noble animation. So with him having a weapon in his primary you know, slot, um, obviously depending on the weapon is going to be different, but let's just put a Bratton in there, basic Bratton, and see, uh, see his little variations in his animation. Uh, so, another agile animation like that, and noble. Interesting, interesting. So, uh, a lot of you guys do like when I kind of float through here and show you some of the stuff. I did, uh, I, I did kind of want to see the the new um, Cyandana on him, but well, there's the coloration and whatnot kind of matches. But I don't know. I'm not too sure. I'm going to try and do a different aesthetic with him. Uh, going to be, obviously, somewhat infested theme, but this Cyandana isn't really doing it for me. So, I don't know. Oh, gosh. I'm like an infested butterfly. Um, anyways, 
pretty cool, pretty cool. So I'm going to work out that kind of stuff on my own time. Um, mm, I don't know. I don't know. Not too sure. Not too sure. If we look at, if you really are not invested or want to invest in the um, in the new Cyandana and you like the Iliac Cyandana, this is what it's going to look like, uh, at least in his his coloration and whatnot. Um it looks okay. I'm not really sold on it. Not quite what I want want to go with. Um, he appears to be, for me, at least a frame that uh, I don't want to put a very rambunctious Cyandana on him. Um, at least that I... Oh, sneak peek. Sorry, guys. That's a Tenogen item that you guys are going to see soon. Tenogen Spotlight. If you haven't checked out my Grax one, make sure you do that. Put it at the end of the video. But, um... I'm planning on doing another one coming up at uh, shortly, um, but yeah, uh, we got the Apoxis. You know what? That doesn't look so bad because, you know, I wasn't a big fan of the Apoxis. I got it anyways. Um, that doesn't look so bad. So maybe that's the way I'll go. Maybe. Uh, let's just drop it on there just for the sake of dropping it on there for now. The Embolus Growth. Maybe I'll go with with that cosmetic choice I'm not too sure the Kuva chest plate mm, maybe not so much I don't know I don't know well I'll figure this out on my on my own time um, but yeah so let's do that let's um, let's check out what was I wanted to do some coloration color variations Ooh, even the Iliacs Iliacs look pretty good I'll admit they look alright on them uh, actually more than alright but not bad if that's the way you want to go feel free um, I'm gonna do at least one just so we can see a a little bit of a variation in his design even that iliac chest plate looks good okay so that's what I'm gonna do I'm gonna pop on that I'm gonna pop on that uh, actually I'll pop on all these embolus things so you guys can get an idea of if you're gonna keep him infested what should he what should he look like um, We'll do that one, or should we do, let's do one Iliac side, one, um, one Embolus side, so you guys can see, uh, based on colorations and whatnot, what do you think? What do you think? Do you think Iliac? Iliac, I think, are, looks okay with the, with the wavy thingies, but I didn't really like it on the back. Uh, it was okay, but, and then left side, oh, that doesn't, that looks alright too, because it's kind of a bony, infested look, so that still looks alright too. But what might decide it for me, to be honest with you guys, is doing a uh, like a, like going through some random colors and seeing what color variations I might like on his uh, on his design. We'll go into a noble stance just because it does look a little bit uh, intimidating, and let's go into some random color schemes. Purplish, I think purplish would work okay with them. I think purple would work okay. With them. Whoa. Huh. What do you think? What do you think? I almost I almost am like sold on that already because muscles and muscles in your body kind of the the purple or not the purple, the pinkish colors, you know what I mean? Like in in the little veiny looks to it. I am almost sold on that. Let me let me uh do a a copy. That might be a too much though. It might be too much. I'm gonna have to decide on it, so I'm gonna flip back over to a uh, to another thing, and let's go through some more random colors. Um, okay, nope, nope, mm, eh, no, not red, white, and blue. A dark, he looks okay in a dark frame. He does kind of look okay. Obviously, when he puffs out too, I almost am gonna have to see what aesthetic I like coloration-wise when his all his stuff puffs out. So uh, I may have to run some. Uh, some missions or something with them to see what I really truly truly like that's too much that's too much let me know what colorations you guys you guys like ooh I wonder if he'd be a good lot like a lava color you guys seen been seeing my orange frames I wonder if he would look okay like that not too sold on it not too sold on it because he is muscly that white and blue was alright uh, purplish mm, mm, white and blue I don't know. I don't know. I wonder, like a sandy color, maybe a sandy color, like a like different different shades of like a, a desert shade or like sandy. I don't know if you guys know what I mean. Rocky colors. Um, uh, 
uh, that looks okay. Some sort of green in them would probably be cool. Uh, green or or like a like a pinkish for like muscle tone might be cool. That white looked okay. That blue uh, maybe I'd have to change up where the where the light blue is and maybe it would be okay. I don't know. Dark colors. I don't know. What do you guys think? You guys like it? You guys think? Uh, you guys like his his first of all his aesthetic. Are you sold on his aesthetic? Um, I wish I could pop out his oh mutation. Guys, guys. Guys, let's go back to our. Oh, what what do you guys think? I don't know. His uh, that helmet thingy looks sick, but I don't know that pastelli that pastelli color, that pastelli color. Mmm, boy. Let's flip through some colors with him looking like this. Maybe we'll get sold on something, like a va uh, in the Valentine's Day palette. I think we get some cool colorations. I think. Wow, not a red, light, and blue. Let's not do an America kind of kind of build. Let's not do that. Ooh, ooh. I don't necessarily like it 100%, but I feel like I could tweak this. So let's let's go into rotation C. I, this is what I like doing. I like getting three different looks, and I like kind of tweaking them and seeing what I end up coming out with. Even even his his mutation with his default colors is super good. I don't know, random, ooh, and ice, and fat, that's just, guys, guys, this, this is, this is a frame, this is a fashion frame design for sure, ooh, almost that white and purple, oh, man, oh, man, guys, I'm loving it, ba-da-ba-ba-ba, ooh, I like that orange with the, uh, with the dark, with that dark, oh, God. Guys, this might be the first frame that I run different color variations every mission because I just, I'm just in the mood for different colors. You know what I mean? Oh, see, like a like a lava e molten color. Whew. He could be like Saren, Saren's brother. You know my my molten Saren. Ooh, which one looks better though? I think that one looks better. I think I could tweak this one to where I want it easier than I could tweak that one. So let's keep. Oh man. What do I go with? Oh, we're getting these molten colors. Let's still tweak this one. There's another pastelli color. Guys. I think I'm still sold on this one. This one's brighter, and it almost hurts me because it's so bright, but I like it for some reason. That doesn't look so bad. Guys, pick this frame up. If you like doing your fashion frame stuff, this is this is a frame. Ooh, even just like this. This almost looks like Volt's uh, default colors. A little bit, a little bit. Not quite as, as greenish. But, um, man, guys, this is great. This is cool. This is cool. Let's go back, pop his mutation down a little bit. He even looks kind of cool, skeleton-y. But that just beats it. That beats it. He's hands down. Guys, I, I've said guys a lot these last past few few minutes, but... Awesome, awesome. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, I hope you enjoyed. Let me know what you think about the door. Let me know about you, what you think about the lore, the door and the lore. And uh, let me know what you think about his... I want it to rhyme again and get a third rhyme in there, but his cosmetics. Let me know what you think about, about Nidus. Nidus. Nidus is Latin for the word nest. I remember talking about this uh, in a previous video, what, what Nidus kind of means way back. Um... Nidus means nest in Latin. Basically, a nest being where the infestation uh, is is spawned from, I guess. So the nest. Ooh, uh, no, that's you can't beat that first one. <laughs> you guys might hate it. You guys might hate that first color, but guys, guys, guys. Oh, I still. Still. All right, guys. Thank you guys very much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. And until next time, make sure you stay tuned. Check out the uh, the quest if you if you want to spoil it for yourself. If you want to spoil that quest and and check that out on my channel, I would greatly appreciate it. Thank you guys. And until next time. Ooh, ooh. I can't stop. I can't stop. I... Blah.